Gennady, firstly, you've got Tigis uh, chatting to the BBC behind mm. us. Uh, firstly, uh, how uh, you know how was it when she broke the, the world record and uh, you know in Berlin to 11:53? And what was your initial reaction to that? Uh, our preparation was very nice. Uh, completely, we try to run. Uh, to break all the records, the pre all the preparation, okay? Even the organization in everything, but we did not say anything before media, okay? Before the races, but the preparation was very nice. Uh, and uh, we celebrate a lot. <laughs> we did not know. Okay. So how's her preparation for London compared to, you know, Berlin last year? Uh, what kind of shape do you think she's in uh, ahead of this race? The preparation was uh, very good in every thing, the preparation, everything is good, okay? But we did not know, the course is just not the same, the tactical is not the same, the organization is not the same. The, this organization was uh, only the pacemaker, also only women race, okay? We did not know how the other our competitor can push, can help. Yeah. But completely, uh, if uh, maybe I'd afraid if no one can not want to push, uh, they cannot run uh, what we're thinking, okay? In my idea, uh, the world record of only women is not past Sunday. Very good. Uh, so they can, I don't know, maybe one can do world record from uh, the group, from the people to this group, uh, someone can do world record. If this world record did not broke in Sunday, maybe it took longer, okay? Long years to uh, wait uh, about this uh, world record. And, and when you think of the strength in depth of, of the women and say it's three out of the fastest four in history uh, and obviously Safan, you know, the, the time she ran uh, last year, how do you view the, the current landscape in, in marathon running and the times are dropping so quickly as well and it, it seems kind of crazy that, you know, we had Paula Radcliffe's world record for 16 years, then Bridget broke it and now Tigist has broken Bridget's record. How, where, What's your view of the landscape? In my side, even the generation, okay? The, the, this generation is a different view for... Uh, I coached the other athletes also before. The generation of now looks very focused for athletics, okay? Very, very, they look athletics as their job. Before they took like fun. Hey, this generation is better generation, and even if we see uh, the shoe shoe technology is very uh, different than before. Okay, by that case, every day they can do the athlete do uh, what is record is changing time to time. Okay, year to year. Okay, that is the the, the thing what we seeing. Okay, before to run. The athlete is afraid. Maybe they say they are afraid after 30 kilometers, maybe I become collapsed like that. This generation is not afraid, okay? They are trying something they want. Okay? Yeah. Uh, that is uh, what what we learn uh, now. If they did not afraid, they can do something. If they are afraid, they can do uh, nothing okay this generation is aggressive in every direction and that mindset the training group that you guys have out in ethiopia can you describe more about that because it's a pretty crazy group when you think of some of the names tamaret tola uh, sise lemma tigas de sefa uh, could you describe more about that group the group is very uh, strong okay we recruit uh, uh, every year some uh, big name okay uh, if we look generally the group now in the topest marathon runner in our group 
that give us very happy okay and we succeeded a lot of goal i hope even for the future we do better okay the group looks even now very competitive in the world but the last success is olympic yeah the last the goal of most athletes is to win olympic to get me that in olympic that is our goal okay we try to focus for olympic paris olympic and we will see who can do something what we thinking as general the group looks very good in this moment it's not bad so far. Not bad. Um, could you describe kind of where you train in Ethiopia, kind of the, the, the landscape, the geography around that, but also kind of how many miles or kilometers the athletes will do a week on long runs, for example, and how they push each other as well, because I can guess there's that competitive spirit there. Uh, for that, uh, when we compare men and the women, uh, it is very difficult different even in training women have uh, own pacemaker okay but the main pacemaker can help them in training also in uh, men they help each other okay they depend with the group the group help each other maybe uh, if uh, when Tamrat race Sisai can help him, they help each other. Okay? Yeah. As general, as general, uh, to get success in the main, not easy. Okay, not easy. You cannot get a proper person to help each other. Okay, uh, somebody not equivalent with the Sisai or with Tamra. Okay, they or young athletes do not uh, help. What they thinking? If you 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 uh, you see the feel of women to train with them very easy. Only depend on the pacemakers. Okay, three four pacemakers you have in front, they can help the athlete. That one is challenging even training. Mostly we uh, train uh, one uh, sometimes 165 to 200. Okay, between this one. Kilometers, uh, kilometers a week, yeah. Okay, but that one not must. Okay, we do not train must. We must cover 165 or 200. Even sometimes, if the athlete did not feel, we cover 120. Okay, we cut some training. With our training, uh, in training, mostly we uh, we see in the performance of athlete on the healthy of athlete okay the recovery of athlete that is uh, we depend on that we did not say our goal is to cover this one and how, how quickly do you know if an athlete is in amazing shape so how quickly did you realize okay Diggis is in really good world record shape or to say is in amazing shape ahead of Boston how, how quickly can you understand that no, uh, we divide uh, training in three months, okay? especially when from uh, near to like uh, I say for, for, for 45 before 45 days before the races. Was you can get mostly we do special training in that time. If they can show us like before the recovery everything you what we get tell us 45 days before the races okay, okay. I, I, even we check one month before okay that one at less than one month only to keep the balance of all training what you we did okay uh, even now for Olympic we start training now okay starting from this point we uh, see how their progress day to day what they show us 
what they show us from the recovery of land okay depend on yeah uh, the athlete okay and uh, just quickly on on tickets obviously she had a, a 400 meters then an 800 meters background i mean she represented uh ethiopia in 2016 in the 800 meters run i think what ran 159 uh in, in lausanne as well uh, how did you first come around how did you first come about her and how, how did that uh kind of journey uh, with tigis occur and getting her into 21153 shape in a marathon. No, no what uh, we uh, nobody plan uh, to become marathon immediately from 800 meters to marathon. Okay, uh, what happened? Uh, she had big injury, in, uh, big injury. When she put the spike, the injury is more. She had big Achilles injury problem. Okay. Uh, the doctors advise her to leave uh, to leave uh, a spike. The spike, yeah. And in this case, when she do a small fast training, she feeling about her tendon. Okay. To protect that one, only her solution is to become a road runner. Yeah. That one is push her for to run marathon okay uh, not she is still she is like to run in track but the case happened on her push her to out of the track okay that one the only solution is to try a marathon in that time the all her training partners running marathon when she trained with them, she looked, she, she ran easily, okay? Easily. By that case, she decided to run. She tried uh, marathon, okay? And so how, how did you first uh, come, kind of come about her? When, when were you introduced to Tigis? And yeah. when did you start coaching uh, Tigis uh, kind of in, in the marathon? And how, how long has that uh, happened? Maybe like now, like four, four years. Oh, okay. No, well, she... too long, too long to become. Uh... And could you tell quite quickly? You know, she did Riyadh, then she did Berlin uh, in 2022, mm -hmm. then she did Berlin last year. Could you tell that she was going to go from 234 to 215 to 211? Uh, what happened when she ran 236? Okay. Uh, in that day, she made some problems, okay? But she is the performance of Karan under 220. She did not want to drop out, okay? Even she stopped in the waiting car after she decided to go, okay? After she stops the races. That one is the case. Uh, uh, when she ran 250, first she is, uh, try a half marathon, okay? In half marathon, she ran very fast. In her zone, in that road to Richard. Yeah. After she wins that one, I, we give to her moral to run. Okay. Even when we put in Berlin, we did not tell to her. She trained with the other athletes. Okay. We put her in some road races. Okay. Ten kilometers like that. After we, she trained with Amani, and she got big moral. She, she says, I can do uh, marathon, okay? Immediately when she, she coming with marathon, uh, she afraid about distance. The performance is there. When the, the other athlete is leave her, she got big uh, moral and she do easily. Okay, that is the history, okay? I guess the obvious question would be then, and you've probably even been asked this before, how quick do you think she can go? I was chatting to Hugh Brasher yesterday, who's the event director at the London Marathon, uh, and I said, do you think a woman in your lifetime can run a sub-210 marathon? And he went before to guest, mm. ran 211.53, no. Uh, After she ran that, and with Sifan doing so well in Chicago as well, he said yes. Do you think that she can get near that in her career, potentially? Without cursing it? <laughs> no, I will. I can't tell to you uh, the truth before they asking us. Do you think somebody can do world record or uh, 
bridge cross gate. I felt to them they can run, okay? They can run under 210 very soon. The, the, this generation, okay? Uh, it ask time or only time of preparation, okay? The women now, how they are focused, very focused for uh, uh, races, for uh, better than men. Women is very focused now. Yeah. Okay? They realize how they can do something better. Okay. By that case, in very few time. Okay. Maybe I don't know this generation or the, or other generation will come. Okay. But to do world record under 210 is possible for many very soon. Okay. In in my limit, 208 is possible for women. Okay. Wow. <laughs> when I see. The training, what they do, okay, they can do 100% to OA. In, in training, if you compare with men and the, the women, yeah, they, 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 it tells to you they can do it. That was that pace, okay. And to to OA, they can do it very easily. And I guess finishing off then, uh, firstly from me, how. You know, do you think that will happen in the next year, two years, potentially? Or? I don't think next year, year why? In this year we have uh, Olympic okay? in Paris, yeah. In Paris, okay. After Paris, the best place for this one, uh, world record is Berlin, uh, Valencia, Chica uh, Chicago, and Valencia. Yeah. Berlin and uh, Chicago is the uh, very nearest for Olympic, okay? At least we have uh, Valencia, but in Valencia, I did not think uh, three men is enough for preparing for world record. The athletes, the most athletes, try this uh, world record in Olympic. I guess most of them is that. If uh, somebody can try, for sure, 100% they can run, and the 210 will listen very soon. And lastly, for me, and the, the, the final point, and I'm aware this has been a quite a, a, a long chat, uh, okay. the shoe technology, how, how, the impact of that, not just in terms of speed, but recovery as well. How important has that been, and what's your view on shoe technology and evolution? I obviously Tigger wore the Adidas Pro Evo 1 prototypes in, in Berlin last year, uh, and, and you know, people, you know, sometimes cynically will say, oh, it's more about the shoe than the athlete. And your view is it a bit of a kind of, you know, you've got to embrace embrace technology because, you know, tennis rackets, for example, have evolved. Cricket, uh, you know, cricket bats have evolved, football evolves. And, and is that your view? No. What is uh, very impressing now, the competition is between companies, okay, to produce, but they did not see uh, only to sell uh, shoes, shoe, okay? Uh, in first 2016, when Nike came with uh, uh, this uh, uh, paper fly, vapor fly, I complain a lot, okay? This one is how how we co compare how we compare the last record in the the record of now. We say the record of before is uh, how can we compare the record of uh, Polar Art Cliff with the record of now? Yeah. Okay. We did not 100% we cannot say this is talent of athlete or the uh, technology of uh, shoes okay that one is what i did not still accept really okay the, this is a big problem ever okay uh, we must have a limit okay we must have the, a limit for it okay okay but for example i want to ask you uh, in track in track you can see uh, light wave and any saran without light wave okay yeah the other run with light wave it is very different okay 
in life if you did not lose any energy if you have you did not have uh, uh, light wave uh, it is some pace you gone 64 some pace 67 uh, it is very difficult okay yeah. we did not have judge the point of the uh, world war record of before and the world record of today okay in uh, my coach of athlete okay i wanted to see how is the different between okay last generation and the today generation. And this generation yeah yeah you, how how we can compare especially in track we we must have we must have something okay with light wave with technology and we must have uh, race out of uh, record out of uh, technology okay we must have now why we say world record with our uh, only woman world record uh, mixed uh, world record we must put like that okay we must thinking about the last generation what they uh, do we uh, we i did not want to forget what they did yeah okay the, yeah. Uh, a baby clara with uh, food okay today generation okay every day is the generation of shoes is different okay that one not limit no we did not limit but at least how can we compare the last record in the record of today